besides dumping and overcapacity, another strategy that is part of this mercantilism is what they've done now with uh, the Section 301 tariffs to get around the tariffs and get around even Biden's latest tariffs. They transship into other countries. A good example is when they they have they're close to 80 percent of the world's solar market, and we're struggling here to you know to keep ours together. So they they went and built plants in Vietnam, Malaysia, Thailand, and Cambodia, and they ship solar panels through them. I we all know it, but there'd been very little effort in Congress to try to stop them. The the other thing that they do is it, it, since they can't ship raw raw steel is a two thirty two tariff and it's twenty five percent, so they backed away from that. So what they do is they send raw steel to other countries around the world, like the United Arab Emirates, Thailand, Vietnam, and Oman. They buy the raw steel, make it into pipes and and products, and ship it into the United States. And to Steve's point about the EVs,